Hey everyone, welcome back to Anita's Joint, hashtag extended joint, where every day is payday, baby. You tuned in to another esoteric football commentary with your girl, Anita Flying High. And we have uh, Kansas City Current versus Angel City FC. If I can find my audio to turn down my headphones, that'd be fabulous. A little bit. Uh... All right, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Kansas City Current lining up in a 4-3-3. Okay. Hey, it's the first match I've actually got to see uh, Kansas. So I, I already been seeing Bay. I mean, Angel City. We got to see them play Bay FC. Um. Oh, well, we got a rookie starting. Rookie alert! Rookie alert! Rookie alert! Uh, Curry. <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is a little different look for Bay FC for me. Uh, but LaRue is back. Thank goodness. Bay FC need everyone. They need everyone. I'm, I'm trying to figure out who did they even draft. Like, let me, okay, we know Curry's here, but she's a she's a defender. Hey, Henri has to be better in the midfield of Angel City. Like, it just needs to be a little better for me. But, uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Uh, let me see something. Let's move it out over there. I hope y'all had a good uh, weekend. Oh, look at Daddy Black, Daddy Blacko. That's Daddy Blacko now. He ain't black. <sighs> That's Daddy Blacko. He um apparently um yeah. Look, you see his stats. Um, and that was a long time ago. That was literally ten years ago. Ten years ago, Daddy Blacko was on top. Ten years ago! And yes, that is his new nickname. I, I came up with it now. Or oh, I've been said it. Anyways. <clears throat> Angel City versus Kansas City. If you've watched the game, no spoilers. This is a recap. This is a rewatch. Um, I haven't watched any of the games besides Houston. And uh, like I said, um, be respectful to me, first of all, for... I haven't watched the game. And I, yeah, you can always see the score line. Like, oh, wow, well, they won. But actually breaking down how they did it is totally different. You know what I'm saying? And then everyone has their own opinions on how what went down and when it went down. And, you know, I'm, everyone has their own individual thought about how that game happened. But hold on. Did y'all see? I didn't even know Emma Hayes got into an altercation with Jonas, the, uh, the... Aus the Austra, the Arsenal manager, she literally shoved him. She Look, she's channeling her inner Sam Curry now. I'm telling you, Chelsea. Chelsea, I can't believe it. Arsenal, it took y'all 116 minutes to actually beat Chelsea. Good lord, I'm glad I didn't. I wasn't available for that match in general. But, uh, uh, yeah, that's not too flash. Oh, yeah. Like, I can't believe what I saw. I was like, in the haze. Come on now. You're supposed to be. Listen, you're supposed to be Team USA right now. We don't do that. We don't be pushing people. I don't. Apparently, something happened during uh, the game with Aaron. And um, she didn't like how it was handled. And I'm like, okay, but that doesn't mean you, like, do that if you don't want to shake his hand you're like i don't want to shake your hand you pushed the guy come on emma you're the aggressor in that one you're the aggressor talk about it, it, it like you can't do that emma oh my god good lord see this is our new manager usa see this is why she should have already been with usa we wouldn't have to deal with this problem well, she wouldn't be plus she wouldn't be pushing people if she was already with team usa she'd be trying to help us prep for the She Believes Cup that we got coming up. She'll be helping us prepare uh, for the Olympics. You know what I'm saying? And seeing maybe any Angel City, Kansas City FC, Kansas City FC, Kansas City players, if any of them deserve a call up. You know what I'm saying? That's what Emma should be doing, not pushing people on the sideline after a match. Oh, but anyways, shout out to Emma Hayes. Oh. Now, um, Chadwick, I was like, wait, wait, Chadwick, I was like, yo. Since when did P.S. Chelsea become the freaking end of his own? No, no, no. Different Chadwick. Okay, okay. Totally different. Totally different. Also, hold on. 
They said that um, Curry for Angel City, it is her, uh, they, I guess her first start. And uh, yeah, I'm excited to see a new player, player that I've never seen before. All the rookies have been, honestly, I am going to keep saying it, this draft class is legit. This draft class for NWSL is legit. It has put NWSL to a, has brought it to another level. And then the signings, international signings, whether, whether they were overpaid or underpaid, they have definitely uh, brought the currency up in the NWSL. And um, that's amazing. So I didn't know that Kansas City had the Brazilian Bia either. I don't know shit, Kansas. So, I, you know, we did have a Brazilian influx like last season, the year before. Um, I guess Marta and Dabinia and other Brazilians were like, hey, yo, y'all should just come through to NWSL. You know, they lit. You know what I mean? We, we all, you know, they lit right now. So, shout out to um, that. But Angel City, we're going to have, apparently Kansas is on fire, man. Kansas booked on Portland. They came back. Like I said, this is my first time seeing Kansas, so I want to see what's all to talk about. And they're playing at home. This is Kansas home. They got a uh, brand new stadium. Um, they kept hyping it the first ever w professional women's stadium ever. Like, can you think about that sentence in 2024? The first ever professional women's stadium ever built. Like in 2024. See, when we look back, as when we get like in 2070 or whatever. I don't know if I live that long, but <laughs> we're gonna be like, damn. They were late. They were late. The NFL has been alive for 11 seasons now, and no one's ever thought about building a stadium for the ladies. Crazy. But it's happened, so I expect, you know, as if new teams get, keep getting created, hopefully not too many, uh, just enough, a healthy league. Um, that's why I feel like, man, there could be you. I missed you missed the game. Which game did you miss? The this game or um the um Chelsea and uh, Arsenal? Oh, this one. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I missed. I missed. I mean, I didn't I miss all games besides Houston because I was uh I was away with family and I I got back Monday so um. Yeah, I was tired, so here I am. Happy March Day on Tuesday. Emsley. Did, I think we did see Angel City win the last match, didn't they? Angel City won. Hold on, let me see. Yeah, shout out to Robinson. I remember watching her last match. Uh, not last match, but last year. She quite was uh, quite interesting. Oh, excuse me, Angel City didn't win. They drew with um, Orlando Pride 1-1. One, one. And Marta got a late, 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 late goal. 88 minute. Mm, 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 mm. So they were very close, but not close enough to get the three points. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> LA's at the bottom of the standings. Oh, Bia, what kind of pass is that? All right. Can we get that touch, though? Oh, she left it off. That's good. That's a great goal. Unselfish. That was, but too much space for Angel I see. Spread out like a... Like a gymnast. Yeah, look at this. It's 2v2 in the back line, and that girl was tracking back. Angel City, where is the defense? Yeah, damn. That is a first, good, good strike. De Bernardo. Hey, you know, you see that number on her back? It says 1 6. You know, I love my players with the 6 on them. You know what I'm saying? I'm not surprised she scored. She got the 6 jersey on. What? Who dropped the assist on her? Tabitha. Which number is she wearing? Number 6. It's all synchronicity. It makes sense. All right. Now. Oh, 
so this is Di Bernardo. Um, Di Bernardo. Well, that was quite early, man. Angel City, y'all defense. Mm -mm. Please. No, 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 no. She was there. She was. It was a perfectly sure. What is it, Di Bernardo? Go. All right, Taylor. So it's one zero already. <laughs> I didn't they scored so fast. Um, not faster than Seattle, but. But it still was an early goal. Um, how so? How big is this thing? It's like a uh. Is this an 18k stadium too? Is it like a 30? I think it's like a 20k stadium. They they have for Kansas. I forgot how big it was. I, even though it's the first one, I forgot. Look, look, look. All right. And, okay. Look. So, I, like, I, even I should have watched the Portland game, but it didn't happen. Kansas Portland. But this game was hard to to convince me. Kansas are oh my god amazing. You know what I mean? But I see some of the players that they could have. But, I mean, I'm used to dash all day, every day. You know what I mean? There ain't no fear. I mean, bring on Kansas. But then again, I thought North Carolina was well, right? And then who they could beat by? They got slapped in the face by Kansas, didn't they? Didn't they get slapped in the face by Kansas? Hold on, let me pull back. Oh, shit. Ooh. Oh no! North Carolina got slapped in the face by Utah. That's right. All right, all right. Angel. That's um. Thompson. Yeah, like I, Thompson is definitely has as she continues to get older, she because she's hella young. Like I said, with Thompson, it is pure raw talent. Like she is not seasoned ew, at all, so it, it's so difficult to have such a young player. Like she's not Rodman. Rodman is talented, but she's not seasoned like Rodman. You know, like some of the other players. She's pure, pure young. They lost Scarlett. Like I said, this Angel City team lost some pieces. If they still had Scarlett, LaRue, and then Thompson, okay, it would help them a little bit better. But Emsley has to step up more. LaRue has to step up more. They have a pretty mature aka just have a lot of players with a lot of caps on that back line with gordon and riley but i mean how you who oh, oh they lost mccaskill as well that's right thank you tim flash and and it just has i don't know i think I'm, first of all who's gonna keep up with chat it don't look like anybody can right now have to and like I said, Ari, you gotta step up. Ari, honestly, I'm like, come on, Ari. I know you play better than this. Like, what are you doing? She has to really dominate the midfield. Like, like, you know, she has to pull strings. Like, she is the OG in the midfield to be able to pull the strings. She has to find the roof. She has to find Emsley and, and see if she can find Thompson. That's her job. So I, I, I'm, I'm asking Ari to, to be better. Be better for Angel City. And, I mean, I feel like she has the ability to do it. Why are you not? Oh my goodness. The, oh, did I see the call ups? Oh, for USA, the She Believes Cup? Oh no, which, we'll look at it. Uh, um, let me see. Oh, is it on, on Twitter? Let's see. For the She Believes Cup or something? Did, did Jane Campbell get called up? Uh, let's see. Uh, where is USA? Did 
Dude, USA have dominated the She Believes Cup. USA 2016, France 2017, USA 2018, England 2019, USA 2020, USA 2021, USA 2022, USA 2023. Y'all just created a tournament so y'all can display shit, niggas. Like, what? Y'all didn't want the last four years in a row. Y'all need to figure out how to get England and France back over here for the She Believes Cup. But they got, I think it's going to be Australia, oh, Australia, it's going to be uh, Canada, Brazil, and Japan, right? All right, Canada, Japan, Brazil, y'all get it together. Y'all get it together. I'm still looking to see um, where the team is real quick. Is it on the, um... Yeah. Yesterday, you would not believe she's 18. That seems to be a common thread amongst these teenagers. We're starting to see Kennedy Fuller out there also for Angel City. That they just have this maturity to them, Leanne. That goes beyond what they can do. And what does... Yeah, you have to do, you know. This well, and here's the thing. Okay, so, yes, they are young, and that's what we want to see. But you... You still need to sh um, shape the team with some older players so they have the, the, the football wisdom experience to give the younger players, which most teams do. Uh, and like I said, uh, we need to uh, let the ladies m mature. I'd say, you know, give them four seasons. Because if they're 18 by four years, they'll be 21. That's legal age to drink. You know what I'm saying? So... That's a good enough time to like, all right, I had four years in the game being a professional football player. I think I'm, by then if you, if you, and especially if you get consistent minutes and you're like playing every minute and now if your team's reaching the playoffs, you're even playing more minutes, you know what I mean? That's fabulous. For like four years consistently, you, you'll get some caps under your, you'll get some reps, you know, that 10,000 hours they always talk about, you know what I mean? Uh... Okay, let's see. Here it is. Oh, it just was it was released two hours ago. Uh oh. What the? What are you calling over? So the ninth annual she believes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. The return of Swanson, Macario, and addition of uh, oh that girl Eva from PSG, L Lilianis. Oh shit. From, uh um. From Ajax, uh, little signals, signals that everyone is indeed still being evaluated. Okay. Aquarius moon though, but I want to know what the fuck. What did Albert say? That was so bad. Oh shit. Oh, shout out to Albert though. You know what I'm saying? She's still, you know, she's 20. Um. <laughs> Hold on. Temperature check. This is what uh Sarah Herrera, young girl, that girl from Attacking Third, she she wrote this article. Shortly after the She Believes Cup roster dropped, recent social media activity by 20-year-old midfielder Corbin out surfaced. They included several anti-LGBTQ posts with plenty of backlash. Oh shit. Uh, and now deleted posts on Instagram. Albert's likes under her profile included that a meme account that stated God taking time off performing miracles to make sure Meg Megan Rapinoe sprains her ankle in the final, e final ever game. Uh, 
The Paris, the PSG uh, player liked the real wishing harm on a legendary player, but the post now appears to be deleted and only exists among screen caps on the internet. What? Our social media activity led to a reaction from Rapino, who has made a critical post on Instagram that shared her, that was shared by many of her current and former teammates, including. <clears throat> Becky Sauerbrunn, Lindsay Huron, Amy, uh, Abby Dahlkamper, among others. Rapino later confirmed that the athletic, the post was a response to. Okay, Rapino le later confirmed to the athletic that the post was in response to Albert's recent anti-trans social media activity. She says after the UEFA Women's Champions League quarterfinals were Albert scored for PSG. What? This is a minute ago. Not a minute ago. I it just like uh, she is an apology in regarding to the backlash she received, liking and sharing posts that are offensive and insensitive and harmful was immature and disrespectful, which was never my intent. I'm really disappointed in myself and I'm deeply sorry. Hmm. But did she get called up? Uh, damn, even, even, uh, I'm gonna have to go, what? So, so she liked to post about Rapino getting hurt? <laughs> oh, shit. I need to know more information. Uh, oh. Lord have mercy. That's bad. We don't need no drama before the Olympics. What's up this man? Like, y'all gotta listen. Can y'all see? This is why y'all stop being woke, man. Just, just, just stop being woke, USA, and, and focus on football. Alright. I don't know what she said, but... People are, in a way, are allowed to share their beliefs. Like, people are allowed to share how they feel. That is something that... And she then she apologized, so it's like I guess, but I really don't know the story, and honestly, that's uh, you don't want any beef. I don't want any beef with USA. I don't want them to be beefing. And Albert's a young player that we don't know her potential, um, and and she's a midfield player, and that's an area of the field that worse USA is still getting better at and building more depth. And Albert could be one of those players in the future because of her age. And so, yeah, she, you know, maybe she did make a mistake. At least she, at least she apologized. But it makes you wonder, what the fuck just happened? Like, what? What? Like, I, bet, I wonder if this was really harmful or not. Like, was it really, like, did they, they probably blew it out the water. But, I mean, I haven't seen it myself. I'm just reading it. But hold on, let me go back. Let, let me go back to, um... Uh, USA roster. I'm gonna have to look into this. This is some interesting shit. Uh, just off of going to the USA roster. Hold on, let me. Yeah, and then we got first of all, so we got Corbin Albert doing stuff. We got Emma Hayes doing stuff. USA. So make sure y'all guys. Okay, make sure y'all guys are. All right, so off the negativity, let's go to the positivity. Let's go to the, uh, where is the, um, bro, where's the team? I thought she, she, she didn't even hear this. No. It was 25 players? Well, I know that Macario, Mal Swanson, uh, Lily, e Eva. Every time I see an Eva name, I think of Wally. Or Ava? Is it Ava? Ava. I think it's Ava. My bad, Ava. Hmm. 
first match against Bay FC, and then you mentioned it when we came on. Where is the roster? Weird. Okay, let's look at this one. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Where's the team? So the five US players not included in the Sheep Leafs Cup are no excuse me. The five USA players not included in the Sheep Leafs Cup roster who were initially named for to the Gold Cup roster are all out due to injuries. Me official. Hold on, that still isn't it. Alright, here's the roster. My girl Jane Campbell. Jane Campbell, Casey Murphy, Alyssa Mayer. So are we surprised really about that back about that back? That goalkeeping? So it's still there. I I mean they still have a transition. Or they're still not allowing uh I mean Murphy I mean God, there you go. Like oh like Y'all really gonna bring her to another Olympics? She's gonna start another Olympics? Like, can you give someone else opportunity, please, in the defense, in the goalkeeper? It's, it's, I know, it's just like, I mean, especially because my girl Jane Campbell's available. Like, come on, like, she's the freaking defender, the goalkeeper of the year. But listen, it's probably not gonna happen, so fuck. Anyways, defenders, we got Ali, uh, Abby Dog Camper, Crystal Dunn, Tiana Davison, Emily Fox. So we have Eva. Naomi Goma, uh, Casey Kruger, Jenna Maxwell. So I like this uh, little uh, back line. Uh, we got some new faces. Um, um, Giatino. Okay. Of course, rookie of the year, former rookie of the year. Jenna, I guess, reigning rookie of the year. Ray Jenna's here as, as well. So I like it. In the midfield, we got Corbett Albert, Sam Coffey, Lindsay Horan, Olivia Montre. On three, ball three. Emily Sonnet is not a midfielder. Uh, Lily Jonas. Okay, so I like the coffee. Her where's Roosevelt? She hurt again. Is Roosevelt hurt again? Oh my God, that girl can't stay healthy for nothing. Like, what's going on with Rose? What happened to her being so injury prone? I feel like this was never her. You know what it was? I bet she, she just got played too much back in the day when she was older, when she was a little younger. They were using and abusing her. Because <sighs> I know for sure she didn't play that much with City. So it was, who was she at before City? Wasn't she at Seattle? She, they had her running ragged, ragged. Her, I hope she gets back because Roosevelt's too talented, man. But I haven't got to see, I haven't got to see, um, uh, even uh, that. <laughs> Blackfellas running, Rose racket. Oh man. But yeah, oh goodness, that sucks for Rose, but she'll come back. But up top, we got Catalina Macario. Welcome back. Alex Morgan, can, can you, Alex, you still get called up? She's like, yeah, man, I'm scoring goals at the Gold Cup. Wait, wait, who won the Gold Cup? Did you say the Gold Cup? There's no way. But I think we are feeling that absence right now, aren't we? Absolutely. Do you want to say really with the Follow me, no Yeah. I can't believe it. It was Lindsay Harondo that scored. And then Alex Morgan scored in the uh the, the uh the challenge cup. That's what I, that's that's what happened. Okay. So Alex is still giving favor. Lord have mercy. Okay, so we have Trinity Rodman. Okay. Oh, Jamie Shaw, Sophia Smith, Mal Swanson. Bro, oh, 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 oh. Makari's not a striker, though. She's a midfielder, but okay. Um, So you can replace Emily Sonnet with Makari, or we can call up another striker, like Ashley Hatch or somebody else. Or somebody, uh, but oh, look at these forwards. Mal Swanson, Sophia Smith, Jamie Shaw, Rodman. Holy mother. Even Makario. These are some young guns. This is this is this is our front 
Oh man, USA. I like it. I like it. Some some players are, you know, like Emily Sonic. Um, I feel like right now our talent pool is too good. I'm trying to figure out where she helps us. Um, uh, Corbin, Sam. I know where Sam helps you, USA. I know where Haran does. Olivia, and I, we haven't got to see Lily play. So I mean, jo I mean, I'm happy for her. She got a call up, and Eva. I'm happy for her too, getting a call up. And maybe, maybe they'll be able to get some minutes at the She Believes Cup. Uh. Based upon, uh, and then we'll see if uh, Emma will, will favor them as well. This, it all depends on uh, this performance and if they get opportunities. And hopefully they're doing well at training because that's that's what's going to get them on the field. Uh, uh, unless you're Alex Morgan, you're automatically starting. And on this scenario. <clears throat> Bay FC, Kansas City, man. I can't believe Houston got their first win this weekend, man. So excited for the dash against the Bay FC. And I, listen, they want at Bay FC in front of 18K. Name another team that can do that. Name another team that can go into the other team's home and beat them in front of 18,000. Okay, you can't. You can't. You can't. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. But it's just, it's just so. I don't even think anybody expected Houston to win that game. I don't know. I don't know if anybody did. Ted Flash, you were hella quiet at the end, man. You were hella quiet. <laughs> then you were hella quiet. I was like, what are you doing? Well, I don't even. Anyways, I'm like, what are you doing, man? Did you, did you, so do you think they can beat Japan? Ah, Japan. I mean, I haven't seen Japan. I know they got my girl Yuri Nagasaki. Yuri, uh, I feel like Japan is going to be. Um, if Japan played like they played uh, against Spain, I mean, they're unbeatable. <laughs> and that, Japan is the only team that beat the World Cup champions. Oh, okay. I was admiring the most. Okay, okay, okay. Shout out to you. Shout out to you. Um. If Japan play like they played Spain in the World Cup, they should be unbeatable. They should be able to technically break down USA. So they should be watching for Phil because that Spain team, even though it may have not had all the great players from Barca, it had a pretty stacked squad and they killed them. Every clinical chance that they had opportunity to get because Spain possessed the ball, they did it now japan can you live up to that game again japan we know y'all world cup champions we know y'all beat usa already y'all beat a world cup champion too well, well before they're world cup champions so with japan they are probably in my opinion uh maybe favorites like because uh, we got to see brazil we got to see canada Unfortunately, Canada got hold at the end because of the conditions of the field. So we didn't really get to see too much of them. We didn't get to see Japan at the Gold Cup, but we did see Brazil. Brazil, did y'all skate through by the hands in the beginning? And Japan's the only team. USA, you know, got lucky here and there. I mean... I'm not saying they didn't have a bad performance at the Gold Cup, but I mean that could that that game that semi those two semifinal games were poor. How could we ever go off that performance? Yes, the final was the Haran goal. Who did they play in the final? Was it Brazil? Yes, it was USA Brazil in the final for the Gold Cup. That's right. So USA got really lucky, really lucky that they faced Brazil and not Mexico. Yeah, because Mexico slapped them in the face. They didn't want Mexico to beat Brazil, man. They're like, oh, no, we can't have, we can't have Mexico play USA. But, um, yeah, USA, y'all don't have to beat Japan. Japan's going to be your biggest test because you've already played Canada and you already played Brazil. Japan is the only team you haven't got to play. That was to, those, those are going to be, that, they're going to, they're going to be your biggest uh, opponent, in my opinion, that was a great question. So, um, uh, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if they can beat them right now. I feel like we have a lot of young, talented players. Like, honestly, our um, it looked like 
Tawinga. It looked like um this is a very very good uh this is how USA is supposed to be looking a pool of a lot more younger players especially before the major major tournament aka the olympics and the olympics Every, we're going for gold going for the glory if usa get on that podium for olympics i'm gonna be like i said with all the teams it it, it, it was just like it's like bound for emma hayes to help usa get on to the podium because no no great britain no big a lot of bigger teams a lot of big nations are not there i'm not saying they're gonna win it because it'd be very difficult to win gold but i mean we're gonna see what happens in olympics so we're gonna see how they do against the, in the sheba lee's cup and all we can ask for is that we don't see bad conditions in the semifinals so we can get an actual good estimate of because after the semifinals matches, everything was like already set in stone. Why did USA have to win the first gold cup? Because it's America. No. Why couldn't it have been Canada? Why couldn't it have been Brazil? No. America. But it didn't look like Brazil were going to beat America in general. Like that, but Canada could have. And they got hold. So USA, y'all got so lucky. I need USA to stop getting so lucky. And, and um, I need them to go out there and earn their dubs. Not ha you know what I mean? Earn the wins on an equal pitch. But, um, oh, I don't know. She kind of dove there. Okay, I forgot. I was like, has this been my first, has this been the first foul? Because I really haven't been seeing any fouls because I haven't been blowing my whistle. But... <clears throat> Where does she come from, Ch Ch Chawinga? What, 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 what team does she play on? Oh, Daddy Blackhole, there's a lot of pressure? Yeah, I don't know how he got a job. <laughs> how did he get a job, Kansas? They're like, yo, we need to channel that Blackhole. Like, yo, did y'all see what he did? How did, you, how did you still get a job, bro? They didn't give him, like, he could have... Like, no rest... No, um, they immediately gave him a, um, oh shit, they immediately gave him a job, so, he's definitely affiliated, oh snap, All right, Thompson. Uh, Thompson, she gonna get in that weight room, get a little stronger. And it's crazy that her baby sister is a football player too, but it's like older sister. She's getting starts, but she's gonna need. Uh, she's and it's like for me too, like. Um, What? Yeah, because fuck education when it comes to... Nah, they'll be alright. Yeah, man, school. Uh, if, you, if you street, if you stream, if you strive to be a professional football player, you don't need no damn college degree. I mean, Angel City holding it down. They had a seventh minute goal, and since then, I haven't really. Well, then again, I've been talking, but I haven't seen what Kansas has done. What are we doing, Kansas? What? What? Where the fire at? Well, let's see, Angel City. All right, I need to get some of that water. Get my mobile, my charger. Spatstra, Spatstra. Oh. 
mentioned the grit this team played with to make the playoffs last year. Really had to fight down the stretch after a rough start. In the trenches. That will be a free kick. Thought so. Do they still have that edge? Finding the balance. Uh oh. Playing possession and having that edge and knowing he said, uh. Kristen Pratt's coming back this season? What? No, that's fine, man. Kristen Press is coming back. CP, 23 coming back. <laughs> Damn, they think it's Savannah McCaskill? They say you ain't got skills like her. Uh, the guy, coach, they used... To have, I thought was good. They made the final and they fired him. And then the lady from last year, I thought did well also. And they fired her too. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. I guess they were already, they, I guess in a way they were already prepping for Black Coat to come back. Maybe it could have been like that. And that's what sucks when you just use people to hold space for someone else you want. Like, what? Like, hey, look, you're we're only gonna be you're only gonna be here for a year till Daddy Black Co gets fired from USA, and we want him we want him back over here. So. Also, where is Endo? Is she hurt? Hey, did she get traded? Is she back in Japan? I ain't seen the girl. Let me see. There's a song kind of with her name in it. Okay, so she still is. Uh, her last match was in 2023. Hold on, with with Japan. Where is she? Is she injured? Oh wow. Endo suffered season ending ACL tear February 14, 2024. Wow. Wow. That sucks for Angel City. She's a great talent. Oh my goodness. But it's just like the, the, the since it's just. Bro, was that? I guess that was it. Outside the box? Was that outside the box or inside the box? Because why did she kick it inside the box? Weird. Okay, I guess it was outside the box. Sid LaRue, gold, gold medal, World Cup champion, Sid LaRue. That's Sid LaRue. But she's a world, world Cup winner and Olympic gold medalist. Damn, she just she has to be the leading lady. She had look and don't forget, Sid is the only one that's had like multiple children. Name another player that's had multiple kids. Sid LaRue has like two kids. Don't she have like two kids? Maybe three? How many kids does Sid LaRue have? Is she still playing professional football? Like you don't you're not seeing that many women do that. Like 
Let me see. Let me see how many kids Sugar Roll has. There we go. Let's see. I know she has at least two. I think she got a boy and a girl. I'm trying to... I thought it was just like bring up her kids, but... Yeah. Uh, here's personal life. Uh-huh. Okay. But set pieces creating at least a semblance of an opportunity now for the team from LA. Yeah, and I think that was a cool. Okay, so we got Cassius was the first born. Okay. Second born. Okay. Okay, so she has two kids. <laughs> oh, you said, is that the Mississippi River? Ah, I didn't get to see it. But yeah, she has two kids and she's still playing. And she had her last kid in 2019, so it's been a little bit. But she's been playing football ever since, like, since she's had her kids, since 2016. 2016, she was playing before. <clears throat> but the fact that she's still playing <clears throat> with two kids later is name of who got two kids right now at home? They got a feed when they go home after a football match. I mean, you know, Alex Morgan has a kid. Just one, though. Sid got, Sid got two. Sid hasn't really been looked at in the USA ever since, I guess. It's been a minute, but... Oh, damn, because she was so open, far post. How did that happen, Angel City? Man, that's very close. People are going to jump over those little gates. Well, I mean, I don't really think... I, my, my thing is, you don't really see people storm the fields that much in America in, in soccer, right? Like, I see it happen in basketball. And it's very... I mean, I know it happens in, like, the leagues, in the European leagues and the men's sides sometimes where people, like, go crazy. But...
What she say? Yeah, we just said no. Why would you say that? You always be transparent, with people. See, they don't. What are you talking about? Don't put the no. It, it's not. There's no pressure. If she look. You, if you don't know if she's on site or not, it, if it's tight, give the player the benefit of the doubt and give them the goal. You know what I mean? If you think it's a goal, I think that's a goal. Now she's on side. If she's, it is very difficult to be like, okay, well, actually, this hair is off side. If most, if majority of her body's on side, and you can't tell because it's so tight, and she, and here's the thing, she's, she scored the goal, it's on side. Give her the goal, and let's move on with the dance. Yeah, that one, that that angle looks like she's on side, and uh, and. Listen, they give us replays of fouls and bar. Look, these, look, they give us replays of stuff and still call it wrong. No matter what they show us. Like, you, no, no, look, I bet, it'd be funny too. Didn't, yeah, it didn't look outside. It don't look outside. I don't think it's outside. So I think it's a goal. Hopefully they don't take too long trying to figure this out. But who scored this again? And let me give us one more replay so I can figure out how Angel City didn't defend this. And how is she so wide open? Give, give us that replay one more time because I, I I forgot. How did Angel City get caught lacking again? Like, y'all keep getting caught lacking. It's similar to your first goal, how y'all got caught lacking. Oh. And see, I'm not really like, I'm not really a Kansas supporter. You know, I'm not really a Kansas supporter. Like, I don't, they don't, like, they don't have players that I, I know about that much, you know? Like, I'm looking at the team, I'm like, like, I don't really, I don't really know y'all like that. You know, I, I kind of fuck, and if I did, I fuck with BFM, I fuck with the Brazilian. Everyone else, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, hey, shout out to Kansas. I like Angel City more because I like some, some, I resonate more with some of the players because I've got to see more of them. So Angel City, I mean, as Kansas City, I'm not, not, not rooting against you, but I mean, y'all got to give me something more. Oh, that's, that's spit up. Sp sp spam Yes, this is a goal. Yeah, she already got it. She said it's a goal. I got it. It's a, it's a goal. 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 All right. So my thing is, is the VA... Okay, you know, whatever VAR. I'm just happy she knows it's a goal. And she got the double sevens. That's a good number, too. Yeah, look at that. She's so open, man. Who is tracking her? Whose job is that? Who is that? Who? who? Alyssa Thompson? Who's Alyssa Thompson? Who's Alyssa Thompson? Is Baby Thompson in the game? Or Alyssa Thompson. That's right. That's her name, right? Oh, well. That's not... She's not the defender. Wait, what the fuck was that that we just heard? Oh. All right, anyways. Yeah, Thompson's not a defender, so the right, I guess you'd say the, the left back was caught missing. Now. Emsley, all right, you got a corner here. That's a quick one. There you go, Thompson. But I like that move. And Thompson, I think you should attempt to uh, look more at film from Hemp. I think if she can study how Hemp plays, 
and just in general you, you you need to play you need to play how speedy players play so you need to look at some of the quickest players we have in the game and see what they do to create opportunities for themselves and like i said i like that from thompson that we just saw um you know getting a quick corner from Inslee and she's inside the box already going for a shot you know what i'm saying so i like it i like it i like it but uh maybe i just want angel city to do well and i'm not really feeling the kansas hype just yet but um maybe it'll, they'll grow on me but mm, so far man she's so getting so much space oh that was a handball maybe when she slid but I'm glad she, no, no, we'll see if VAR comes back to that. But it looked like when she slid that the ball. And maybe it's because I want Dabinia to play. Maybe I like Kansas with Dabinia and, and Hamilton. Maybe it's the new, you know. Where is Dabinia at? She hurt. I, she got hurt, Dabinia. And maybe I'm salty Sam Ewis isn't coming back. Y'all then y'all made Sam Ewis like it. Y'all like, no, she heard Daddy Blackcoat was coming to manage. She was like, oh, hell no, I'm retiring. No, I'll pass. I'll pass. I'll, I'll, I'll stick to podcasting. I'll stick to podcasting. I'll pass on that. Next. Next. You know what I'm saying? Because we could have had Sam Ewis. We could have had North Carolina all over again with some better players or just in general but it didn't happen and then I can get behind Lynn Williams Dabinia, Sam Ewis did I see did you see that Sam Ewis thing they had after the first in North Carolina coach game? no but I knew she was in the building I knew that she was um in the building for that match against Houston where we got obliterated but no what do they do for her did they give her something all right thompson capitalized go to the left left yep shot 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 oh it was deflected oh good look though good look Oh, that's the opportunity to have she scores a goal right here. Did, did they retire something of hers or something? Yeah. Mm. They retired her number. She was on the field talking and even the mayor was there. Yeah, shout out to Mewis. I always liked her. Uh, she played for Manchester City as well. Helped them become, helped them uh, win a couple of trophies during her tenure. So yeah, I, I like Mewis. She's a Libra as well, so I, I like her energy. She she never. It was so funny too because you know what I think happened <laughs> when the USA won the World Cup. There was multiple videos of Sam Mewis drunk as hell, <laughs> and and um. Oh yeah, yeah. Ah. But um I don't know. And then she I don't know if she got hurt after that, but just in general, she played a lot of football during that time that she was popping. She made her move to England and all that stuff and went in. And then I think she got hurt when she came back or she got hurt while at City and then she was like, "You know what? I'm going to just go ahead and put him up. I already done it. I already been done it." And sometimes that's all you need. And, you know, as long as she's happy, that's all that matters. But I've always liked Sam Mewis. I've always liked both Mewis. It's funny, too. Because Krista Mewis played for Houston Dash for such a long time as well. And she's a good baller. And Sam Mewis played for City for a little bit. And she was a good baller. So I've always liked the Mewis sisters. Um, they, you know, they got good currency. I mean, they, uh, football-wise, um, you know. Oh, there we go. There we go, LaRue. There we go, LaRue. See what happens when you provide a service to Sydney LaRue. She will deliver. Hey, Sid the Kid. Absolutely brilliant. You can see here, Claire Emsley gets it. Cuts inside. Absolutely brilliant. There you go, Emsley. That's a good goal. I'm... 
But well, I forgot what number she was. And it's surprising that... I was like, did, did, did Sam U.S. ever suit up for Kansas City? Or was like North Carolina her final NWSL team? It makes me wonder. I, it must have... She ever suited up for Kansas City, or maybe she did. I don't remember. It's game back on, baby. <laughs> well, that's good, Angel City. That's what y'all need. Y'all need the big play. Oh, dang! You gotta be stronger with that. You gotta be stronger with that. Fucking hell! Yo, you gotta be stronger for that tackle. Be us like, bro, get in the lane, bro. You can't bully me off the ball. Oh. 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 Bruh. Me was like, she felt that little nudge. She's like, is she trying to tackle me? Is this what she call a tackle? Look at her. They're so stretched, too. Look at Bia. She just stands and she doesn't even move. Oh my god. But watch me. Watch Yeah, she's a strong Brazilian. You you want to need a little bit more strength on that. That was Nielsen. Nielsen. Ye -ye -ye. Well, Kansas. <laughs> Chalinga. She's got a goal. Well, that was a good goal for her. I'm not too sure how many goals she scored already. But. <laughs> Bia Bia! Really? Because she didn't look that strong compared to Bia. And she's Brazilian. All right. Now, 3-1, three, three, they just... All right. 3-1, they just got conceded on after they just scored Angel City. Now you have to do it all over. <coughs> now, that's a little difficult because you spent all your energy just to get the goal back. And you're the... Y'all you, are the first ones to score in the second half. Y'all actually had the response that y'all needed. And, uh, yeah, I think they think the tackle was a poor time tackle. Uh, so, they'll be better. They're going to have to be better.
2022. They've had injuries. Sarah Gordon, Kristen Press were two of their main faces early on, along with Sydney Lewis. But they felt like this group is deeper than any they've had before. They are starting with some confidence under Becky Tweed. Yes. No doubt taking a punch to the face here in Kansas City. Can they punch back? They have, and I think ultimately, when you have this type of crowd on your side as well, we've said it many times, Jen, when we've been here, when the opposition score, it's like you have to take a second look to see if it's actually gone in the back of the net because it's so silent. So I think what they need to do, Angel City, is continue how they started this half because they've started this second half much better. Which is too good. Wheeler in the box. Oh, good interception. Yo, Chad Winger. Chad, Chad Winger. She's been well too though. She's very quick, so she's able to get into the able to react quicker than most players. She's been pretty I don't even know where she came from. Like where where did she let me see where she was at before she came to end of the cell. Like I don't even know this girl. Okay, so she's from uh Mal Malanian. She's a Malanian. Malanian. Let's see if we can get a Wikipedia on her real quick. Uh. All right, let's see Wiki. Okay, let's see where she was before here. Okay, so she was playing in Wahoom? Wahoom? Jensen? Holy shit. She had 84 appearances and she had 83 goals from 2020 to 2023. And now she's with Kansas City. She's been with the uh, Malai national team. Um, she has a uh, 14 caps plus, 22 goals plus. She's 25. She's a Virgo, borderline Virgo, Libra. Gang. Let me see. Where is this country at? Oh, she was playing in the Chinese league. The Chinese Women's Super League. Damn, she scored a lot of goals. She, her last from 2017 to 2023, she has, so from 2017 to 2023, so that's like, what, 20, that's six years? She has a 138 goals and... Uh, she has 138 goals and 144 appearances. That's crazy. I understand why they sound good. Let me see. The team that she played for before that, she played uh, in Sweden for a team called Karvandesen. Karvandesen? She had 57 appearances and she scored 55 goals. This is wild. She was like a teenager in these times because she's 25 right now. Sheesh, so she was killing the she was killing the Swedish league and the Chinese league. When we and now she's in the end of itself. So it's good that she's here so we all get to know. Maybe that's why she's so damn like she already like dropping us in that shit. Ma I never heard of that uh, nation Malai, the Malawi. She's a Malai Malanian. Malanian. Uh, a descent apparently, but you already know we don't we don't believe in none of that stuff <clears throat> but <clears throat> For football for football purposes And uh, Tigas whooped on Puebla. I, I was like, ah, uh, because I was like, you know at home whatever I wasn't here I was like, oh man, Tigas are gonna I was like Tigas gonna play <laughs> And they whooped up Puebla I was like 6-0. I got to see if Vix has that game because I wanted to see who, who got that. Who got the dubs? You know, it's always nice seeing, you know, the, t the, the Mexican ladies, the Tigas ladies. 
Uh, they put six up on them. You know, that's my number. So I was like, oh, what the? Hey, but they play Club America this coming Monday, I think. So next Monday, that should be good. Well, the Chivas game, based upon the Monterey game was weak. The Chivas game was better. Now we're just going to see Club America. Are y'all going to be the grand finale? <laughs> Kansas City. Ooh. Good tackle. I guess. Curry, like, look, I'm cooking. She want a foul. Spit, spit up. Let's see. Uh, she probably did catch her a little bit. <laughs> she got the Sprouts game. Is it? She, 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 she did get her a little bit though. It's not no cap. Three one Kansas. For Angel City? Oh, for Kansas, okay. Oh yeah, there she is. She can't, I was like, yeah, she's Canadian. But she's OG. She's an OG. She's old though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> shout, shout out to B Buchanan. I got think. I think Buchanan's a Virgo. Let me find. Uh, Kadisha Buchanan. There she is. Buchanan is probably like 20. Not this Canadian. This Canadian. There she is. Yeah, she's she's 28. She's November. Oh my god. Bia's gonna score. Oh, 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 oh. she missed it. Hey, you set her up. I thought you was gonna kill it, Bia. Come on now. Yeah, why is she waiting? Uh, yeah, it was, uh, what the fuck? No, I can't do it like that. Sometimes what I love about this Kansas City current team is they can turn in the blink of an eye. When you see Jawinga making those moves and Bia, Eddie France has that in a locker to be able to just hit them in behind. Hmm. Oh, damn, she's Angel City now? Is this right? Tell me this is not right. I keep forgetting she's Angel City gang. Stop benching right. What are y'all doing? Is this her? 
Well, that's great. Raquel Rodriguez is Angel City now. This helps. But some great oh, Angel City, stop bitching her. She's a starter. She led her team in goals and she's on the bench. Well, at least she's coming in for the room. Oh, goodness. Start. You can start her with Sid LaRue. Make it a 4-4-2, man. You're going to have to change something tactically. You can put... Look, you got to put... To me, it looks like the, the water is the river. It's going the wrong way. <laughs> oh, man. You're like, what, what's going on? It's, it, everything is... In, every Thing is in reverse in the matrix though, so I'm not surprised. Henri is off. I think it'll be also interesting, Jen, to see what Becky Tweed does with the fact she's got Messiah Bright and Sydney the Rue available when they're both available at the same time. Because I think you need what? to wait to get both in some. What? What What did I just say? What did I just say? I just said that. I just said that. Yep. Mm-hmm. Sounds like we know how, uh, you know, we know what's best for the team. Yes, June Endo. Shout out to her. Give her some love. What the fuck? She's gone. So, yeah, Angel City, <laughs> they got key injuries. Like, if they had Christian Press, if they had Endo, it would be great. They would, we probably would have a better, we would probably have a better Angel City. But we don't got them. All right, now Kansas is different, right? They look like they got new signings. They got they got Brazilian girl that was just in the World, World, World Cup and the Gold Cup. Of course, Daddy Blacko, plus a new stadium. So they got a lot of good currency in uh, Kansas. And they got others. They got former uh, USA goalkeeper French. So, uh, Wheeler. Yo, Allie Riley, man, you gotta keep up with that girl. Yeah, cause they needed the double team. She was she was going full force. All right. There's the whistle. <clears throat> Quick lift of the head from Doherty Howard. All right, let's go. We got Thompson making that run. Good, good, good. Oh! See, this is when she gets stronger, and she's going to be able to hold on. She's going to... Not only is she going to beat that girl to that ball, she's going to have the strength to finish it. She's going to first time finish it. Or maybe it's like her touch or something. She's going to beat that girl next time. And she's going to have the strength to put her body in front of her. And there, Thompson, she made a great run. That was perfect. Oh. It hit the post. Hey, we were so dumb. Since 2016, winning the 
Oh, okay, I'm looking at the river right now. Okay, I see, I see. Ooh, it looks dirty. <laughs> <laughs> <That's it. laughs> All right, Angel City, y'all gotta figure it out. Y'all gotta got, I got twenty minutes to get a goal back at least. Y'all got Masai Bright hitting the post. Maybe she could have, she could have, she should have came in earlier. Yo, is Kristen Press really gonna come back for camp for Angel City? I can't believe it. Let me see if I get some. Uh... Kristen Press. Angel City. Is she coming back here? Man, she's thirty-five. Kristen Press. Oh. Uh, let's see. She hasn't said she's done, though. But she shared an injury update in January. And she's been gone since the 2022? Okay. Whoa, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just Women's Sports made an a article five days ago saying, Chris and Pest back training with Angel City FC? This was posted March 8th, March 28th, March 28th, 2024. Let me subscribe to her. City FC coach Becky Tweed said on Wednesday that Press is back with the with the team full time as she continues to make her way back from an HL injury. While she's still working on rehab, her being back with the team gives staff a better picture of her progress. Nice. So Press is back. She's gonna get back. Is Press gonna make the Olympic roster? <laughs> Well, probably not, but it's great that to have a player that still wants to play football. She's been gone for an injury. Angel City could use her. Like, that's another thing. It's not like she's coming back to a stacked team. She's coming back to a team that actually can really use her influence. Uh, so, and then again, it's like you want to be, if you're an athlete, but just, you know, you're a person, but you're a professional athlete, and this is, you need your body to be working. Uh, um, your legs to be working, everything to be working to be able to play this game. That's a foul. Bia, Bia, Bia. I can't like it. Bia, Bia. There's a song. I, I, I gotta refine that song. It's like a rap song. It's like a rap song. Yeah. Oh, you got landed on two. She took she took one for the team. Neil said, "Damn, we a fell on you, y'all." And she got a yellow card. Landed on and get a yellow card. Only versus Brazilian. Yeah, Nielsen, you she's she's been she's had it rough today. She hasn't been it's similar to how Alex Greenwood got bodied by Ramirez, like majority of the game. She don't have the strength to match up against this powerful striker. So you have to use your different tools in your toolbox. <laughs> Kansas 
Get that hydrate. Wait, wait, wait. Is there a hydration break? Is this what this is? Is there someone down? Chowingo to mid. Yeah, they had that good run from. They had that good run from uh, Thompson, and she couldn't get there. And it, it, it was just like a dagger, real quick, right after Sidharu got the goal. And Kansas City went and bam, scored right there. You know? Oh. Until today. Oh, Lord. It's okay. I mean, he's just conceded five, you know? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Oh. There you go, parents. There you go. Look at them. That's what we love to hear about. Parents supporting their child's visions and aspirations and dreams. <clears throat> because that's what we need more of. And, and, and they told us to dream big. They tell us to dream big. And, and then it's like we get out in the world and we're like, well, that's not realistic. You just told me all my life to dream big. And I tell you my dream. You're like, no, it's not. There's no way that's going to happen. You know what? Thankfully, I don't think like you. I believe that I can bring my dreams to reality. Or they say dreams, your dreams can become reality because that's how it's supposed to happen. That's supposed to, that's, that's how it's supposed to work. Through your imagination. Little punch there. It wasn't really a threat. Hey, did y'all hear me? Okay, so, okay, so we've had so much craziness. Apparently, there's some guy after said there's some guy calling for Sam Kerr's captaincy. Talking about she should be stripped of captaincy over your stupid bastard comment. Oh, it's a go. Angel City back at it. 78 minute. Who it is? Who is she? Another corner. Yeah, all clean, baby. Number 27, yeah? Yeah, good, good, good assist. Number five with the assist. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Curry got a goal. We just gotta keep doing more games together, Jen. Every time we come here, the momentum again was with Kansas City current. Hey, Angel, look, we just is Curry from a dash? No, she's a rookie rookie. She got drafted. She fresh in the gates. She fresh in. I think she got drafted this year. I think because it well, I think she did because they said this is her debut. Uh, well, obviously not her debut, but her first start. But I'm thinking this, um, so sorry, for sure, if it's, I think she's a rookie now. <laughs> to answer your question, I think she's a rookie. She ain't, I don't remember her being no Dash family member. Um, yeah, man, like that. 3-2, Angel City. Way to come back. And uh, we got 10 minutes. Y'all can, can figure it out. And uh, Ipsley, like to say, keep being, keep 
keep putting in those cr crosses and uh, those corner kicks are very efficient. Like I said, you have Raquel Rodriguez in the midfield now. Look, this is this. Okay. You're back on uh, Maybe, I'm not too sure. Maybe you can stack up more, a little stronger. But your midfield could be Raquel, Henri, uh, Emsley, um, someone else. And then your your front two for sure could be, um, oh, you know what? Because do you want to have Emsley, LaRue, and Bright all play? So it could be a 4-3-3 a three, three and have um, Henri, Raquel, and um, who's going to be that third midfielder? Dottry Howard, somebody. So you got R Rodriguez. There you go. See, she's the one that's going to be making. Uh, yes, yes. They need to start her. It's good that she's back or she's healthy or whatever. That will be different moving forward. Yeah, so for right now, until maybe you get some of these other players back, you put Henri, Raquel, Dottry Howard, and you could put. No, no, no. It's going to be a 4 4 2. It has... It's like I can't even do other players. So I'm trying to figure out. You got to play Bright, LaRue, Thompson, Emsley, Henri, Raquel. Those six players you need to play. And then the rest of the six, you, you'll do. The rest of the six, you'll do. You'll have to figure that out yourself. We're ready, we're ready, we're ready, we're ready. <laughs> you ready? Spencer. Yeah, Allie Riley, she's had it rough. Yeah, yeah, but she had she she hasn't really been that well. Speed. Oh, well, she's speedy. She's fast. This wasn't too bad of a game. Like I said, this wasn't a... This wasn't an easy contest. Angels uh, for Kansas. Yeah, two two mature players. It's what you need. It's, it's good to have on your bench if you're Angel City. <clears throat> All right, Bright. <clears throat> and I wonder if Bright could be more like if Bright's archetype could be like Marie from France for PSG because they have similar builds. So she needs to stay in the box a little bit more. Hold up. She can hold up the ball and everything. All right. Crowd understandably not liking these corner kick opportunities. Emsley looking to create again. Bouncing ground. This is how the last one scores. Oh! Go! Trainer, 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 trainer. Yo, it's 3-3. Three, three. Just like that? Damn, who the hell is down right now? TKO. What? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, Nielsen. She's on the ground. Raquel Rodriguez. So this is her first game for Angel. So she's, she's an instant impact. That's for sure. Another corner from the same side. Oh. The only thing is that when that girl with the oh, it was. Yeah. 
Please, <laughs> watch Blacko. Blacko, what are you doing? Your team has been. It's interesting because Vanessa Di Bernardo went out of this game, and I wasn't quite sure if that was really the right time. They seem to have lost their way a little bit. The Kansas City Current. There's still time. Five minutes to go. Plus, stoppage time. Nielsen is going to be okay. Wow. Blacko and Danoski will be so disappointed they just can't see out these games. Yup. It's 3-3, three, three. Raquel. What was this? It's like the 84th minute? Well, it's neck and neck, man. Two goals from like in less than 10 minutes. Angel City has come alive. I didn't know uh, April was uh, National Autism Awareness Month. Shout out to y'all. What is she looking at? See, that's right here. It's this. Like, they're offside. Those two Angel City players. But I thought that's what they were looking at. But then when I looked on the replay, it was actually a Kansas City player that touched it first. But it still doesn't. But even when she did, like on that replay, when she did touch it, the Kansas City player, by that time, the players had already made their way back. They were level, right, right here. Boom, she's about to touch it. They're above. Like, because she's, I don't know. Because then... I don't know what they could be looking at. Like the the if the only thing is because who kicks the ball to? Oh shit! No goal. So, because it, 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 number seven does head the ball, and damn, that sucks. Uh. Another sellout, 11,500 here at CP. 
Oh, so they got like a 11,000 seat stadium? Well, 11 that oh you said um I still have a feeling we could see another goal within this game Jen. I really do fair play to Angel City because they really got after it in the second half so much better than the first half yeah yeah it, and what I yeah it, it sucks on that one because when the corner when the corner was played in and uh, what'd you say, Izzy Rodriguez? Oh, wait, you said, hold on. Which one? Yeah, because so practically they're saying because number, uh, who was it? Yeah, number seven, when she headed it back towards the goal and then it hits 94. Before that, because they were in an offside position when she headed it, and it, 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 honestly, it shouldn't negate, in my opinion. There should be a rule where, well, if they're not, the, oh god. What happened, Anderson? What? She didn't catch it? Bruh. Why did she catch it? Oh. She always does that. I love Bia. She must be a sub. Oh my goodness. Well, Bia. She's got herself a goal. The Brazilian. And she's almost as big as my dog. <laughs> Black hole was not sucking out. Well, that was her last contributions. A goal that's all. Dang, so. Oh, yeah, it's like every time Kent, every time Angel City made a comeback. Across the other side it goes, Emsley. Ball still bouncing, that is finally in the gloves of Franch. Doherty Howard, I think, from close range, had the ball hit her head. Nope, let's see who is that who got hit in the face, oh my goodness. I think Maggie Doherty Howard just took the ball yeah. to the face in oh. that moment. Mm. No, nah, it's they can see the and when the ball's still in motion and still active, you can see that the ball just hits Meggy Dante Howard in the face. Madison Curry does a really good job of keeping the ball alive. Kansas City Curran in the first half, I was complimentary of their defending. I thought it was exceptional. In this second half, Angel City have caused them a lot of problems. Couple of 
defensive substitutions were made for Kansas City after that be a goal. Foul here. Number two, Reagan Siegletter. One of those changes on for Kansas City. Mm. The Danish international trying to help the current see this one out. It is a fight to the end, a yellow card. I was about to say that was definitely a booking all day long. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think Claire Emsley's been a bright spark in this second half for Angel City. Not just on set pieces. game here Jeff. I mean so far I don't see why we would argue that it has been nothing but entertaining <laughs> yeah it's been a pretty decent match I'm not gonna lie they're pretty got six goals tonight damn you know that's my number <clears throat> Hey, and uh, Houston got that big three, big three points as well. No, no. Now this game was not what I thought it was gonna be because when I heard Kansas won, I was like, "There's no way." I mean, eh, eh, eh. I want to see Kansas City versus uh, Gotham. How are Gotham gonna listen? Gotham. Are Gotham a super team still? With all, I, I just like I said, I don't consider anybody a super team in, in the NBA because there's just too many talented teams, too many talented players in general to have one super team, and there's not super just because there are USA players. What about the teams like Orlando that have maybe majority Brazilian players? They, we don't call them super teams. We don't need no super teams. Because it's it, that's dumb. I'm just saying like, oh, there's a, they're only the best ones in the league. It's a super team. What the fuck out of here? Williams hasn't been playing. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> yeah, I think so. They don't got no Williams, no Rose Lavelle. So they just say, Perks out. Damn. So it's just, it's just, it, oh, it's, oh my goodness. Wow, I thought it was a goal. Yo, she does. What is she doing? Yo, that was a sitter. Come on now. Make them burn. Wow, she missed that. But it is what it is. Um, yeah, so they're not even a super team. Nobody's healthy. Rose's not healthy. Williams not playing. Purse is out. So you have, who did y'all sign? Y'all signed Emily Sonnet. Okay. Y'all signed Davidson. Okay, at least she's back from injury. At least she's playing in a role where she could be beneficial. And then who else did y'all sign? Yeah, uh, Tavina, she's been good. Next time she'll probably just go for goal herself. She's like, man, last time I passed to you, you walk, you whipped. What do you call it? You whipped at it. Yeah, that's a good goal. She scored 138 goals in the last six years. You know she's no know you know she knows how to put the ball in the back of the net. 138 goals in six years. Last season she scored 83 goals. Oh, that should have been a goal. Come on, man. What's going on? Yo. They could have scored two goals just like that. Man, she took that challenge like a G. Nielsen bit on the ground. Nielsen, how do you challenge the girl and you fall down? Hey, hey look, Kondalji? Can't 
came on and like oh, almost scared me because she was real good against Houston. I was like, damn, she scored a wonderful. Here they go again. Oh my goodness. She's oh my god, that's scary, yo. And she's a Virgo, so she's gonna she's a master. I think we have one minute left. Yeah, so is this it? Is this the last minute? Right? We're... And this is why it's good to have playoffs in a league like this. Because anybody can beat anybody on a given night. And when you have the playoffs... And here's the thing. I can see... Oh my gosh. Messiah Bright. Jeez. Right. If, she, if that goal wasn't snatched away... Yo, haven't we already had 11 minutes of additional... I'm thinking, what's 90 plus 11? Yo, ref, blow the whistle. Now they, they back on ESPN. That's fabulous. That's exactly where you need to be on a sports channel. And the show, y'all should have never left ESPN. I think they left ESPN for that moolah, uh, and now y'all back. They left ESPN for moolah from CBS, and now they're back with ESPN. Should have been stayed with them. Referee, what's 90 plus 11? Well, thank goodness. This was a pretty good game. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Anyways, thank y'all once again for tuning in. What the fuck? What the f What the f What the f They said that whistle was for offsides. The audacity. They finessed us. I was finna the call it curtains. No. <laughs> Said it's eleven minute. They finally. Anyways, thank you all everyone for tuning in. Oh, they already cut the feed. Thank you everyone for tuning in to Anita's Joint Test Text in the Joint. Where every day is payday, baby. It's your girl Anita flying high, flying out of this third dimensional reality, and I will see you on the next one. Kansas City 4, Angel City 2. Even though they got robbed on that equalizer, 3-3 three, three would have been way better, but it is what it is. I'm going to see you on the next one, all right? <laughs> Deuces.